Okay, we're going to show you how to use an architect scale today. Take two. Take two. <laughs> okay, we're looking at uh, a three-fourth inch scale as well as a three-eighth inch scale today. Um, each of these hash marks here, or are you supposed to point out? Would you like me to? I will. <laughs> yeah, okay. Each of these hash marks here um, represent uh, a f an inch or foot. And as you're reading them, um, you're looking at the three-fourths inch scale, um, you're going to read from left to right. And then if you're looking at the three-eighth inch scale on the far right corner, you're going to read from right to left. So it would be one, two, three. Okay, and now we're going to go ahead and draw an 11 inch line with the three-eighth inch scale. And a three-eighth inch scale represents uh, one foot zero inches. And each of these little hash marks represent an inch. Ta-da! An 11 inch scale, or an 11 inch line. Okay, the next one we're going to do oh. is, oh, 11 foot line. No, inch. Inch, yeah. My bad. Inch. It's, it. it's fine. Mm -hmm. Should we start over? <laughs> no. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> um, using a one-half inch scale, or, yeah, half inch scale, we're going to draw, oh, excuse me, one-sixteenth. Mm -hmm. We're going to draw a 22-foot, 10-inch line. Now, when using a one-sixteenth scale, you're actually going to use a 1 8 scale and divide by 2. So for a 22 foot 10 inch scale, we're actually going to draw a line that is 11 feet 5 inches. So 11 feet. Okay. And again, we do apologize for the focusing. Anything else? Good? I think we're good. Bye. Bye. Bye.